Okay. R roar and go. Roar and I'm ready to go. I'm ready to roll. Hello, everybody. This is EC Freed here and Zenrev32, bringing you some Borderlands 2 DLC gameplay. We have leveled up two guys to level 50 for you guys. <laughs> we were kind of having some fun playing around Borderlands 2. We wanted to play some DLC. We got the DLC together. Um, both me and him know little about the DLC, so this will be a little bit of a blind playthrough when it comes down to the DLC. And the first one we decided on was Tiny Tina's Attack on Dragon's Keep. Yes. So do this. Tiny Tina is the bomb. So, according to the thingy I saw to start the DLC, we go to the unassuming ducks of potentially little importance. I assume it's the unassuming ducks. <laughs> huh. I assume this too. Here we are. Boing, sentry. Here for this. Oh. Step on the time. The vault hunters play the game. I love the intros in Borderlands too. The world yes. Is our most desperate hour. Unless we make a stand here and now, we gonna die. Now. Well, for initiative! What's initiative? It says which order we attack at. I punched the initiative. What's going <laughs> on? I wasn't paying attention. <laughs> Tina, why don't you start over? <clears throat> Welcome, fine ladies, to your first session of the most coolest game in the world Bunkers and Badasses! As your bunker master, I will be spinning today's tale of fantasy and... Wait, why the hell are we playing this kid's game? Oh, you know, maybe because... Shut the hell up, Morty! Tina? She's right, though. Shut up. While our vault hunting buddies beat the slam a jam out of that Hyperion informant downstairs, I thought we could play a game. Now, pick your characters. You got the Necromancer, the Pando, the Siren... Siren. Dibs. My Siren's name is Brick. And she is the prettiest. <laughs> <laughs> Tina, we're going to start now and figure that out later. Well, you know we gotta wait for Roland before we start. Tino, Roland's... You know, Ooh. Roland's not coming, right? He's not... here anymore. Yeah, he's probably running late or something. We'll just start now. So, like I said... Roll for initiative, sucker! Oh. Uh, Snap. Snap. <laughs> That was a pretty sweet intro. You mm -hmm. arrive at the docks of Flame Rock Refuge. I need to turn this up my uh, really voice nice chat. Until the handsome sorcerer messed everything up. I say we head toward the town to investigate. Heading toward the town. Oh my god. Woo. Beautiful. Double rainbow. <laughs> I can't believe like that Easter egg with the jacket is just like, oh my game. god, is that a double rainbow? That's the greatest thing. From... Wait, yeah. didn't you just say the sorcerer messed up the town? Why would things be lovely? Yeah. Uh, whoops. Uh, what I meant to say is, it's eternal night. And oh, music, oh no. And the whole area kind of smells like butts and dead people. <laughs> it smells like butts. Dead people. <laughs> Suddenly you're attacked by a horde of skelly men. Oh no. They shooting at you. Skelly men. These skellymans are no match. We are clearly superior. Yes. It might also have something to do with the fact that I have the conference call on the B, but we'll ignore that. <laughs> hmm. Hmm. And moves. Oh, I'm liking what's going on so far. I wish the town stayed pretty though. Yeah. Whoa. And it didn't smell like butts. Boats and dead people. <laughs> Boats and butts. Suck it, skeleton warrior. You want no match? Get out of here. Oh, that moose. <laughs> Your turret got in a little late there. A little bit. A little bit. I kind of just so tossed loud. it at that point for dramatic effect. <laughs> the explosion is so loud. I gotta actually turn that down in the like effects volume because it's just gonna go. You get close to the entrance to Flame Rock Refuge, but suddenly. Suddenly what? Oh no! Oh. Handsome dragon! A handsome dragon! Surprise attack! Go! What? Whatever! <laughs> This is bullshit! Oh! 
Tiny hey, Tina. Are we done now? Tina, uh, you can't start your campaign with a boss fight. What is Players this? can't win. Mm. Touche. Okay, everybody back up. Yay! Oh, okay, I was scared there for a couple kills. seconds. I was kind of odd. Okay, how about a new boss? He's a skeleton. Okay. And his name is... Mr. Bony Pants Guy? <laughs> oh no, watch out! It's Mr. Bony Pants Guy! Does that work? This please. Works for me. Oh no, he's on me! He knows about my strength! Whoa! Take down Mr. Bony Pants Guy! We did it. Alright! The road to Flame Rock Refuge is open! You should go there! Go, go, go! Wait. Go, go, go! Go, go, go! We're on our way, Tiny Tina. You're dead. So that was a boss. Oh yeah. my god. Back up, back up. Oh my. Okay. I guess not. You. He's not taking much damage from me. No, he's not. I'm doing like a lot of damage and he is not going. Okay, he's dead. No, he's not. Come on, die. You're so close. Okay, he died. He smacked you in the butt and then he died. That works. Change my volume really quick. Oh my god. I'm liking this. Steel is amazing. Totally worth it. Oh, that's cheating. Don't think about doing it. Oh snap! Good job. <laughs> you just, did you just shoot yourself. Yes, I did. <laughs> Get up. Let's do this. Come on, stupid Mr. Bony Pants guy. It wasn't even Mr. Bony Pants guy. <laughs> oh, okay, stupid Mr. Bony Pants's guy's cousin. Stupid Mr. Bony Pants is your rock launcher blowing you in the face. Hmm. Okay, <laughs> it probably was completely my fault, but I'm gonna pretend like it wasn't. That's been my fault. It may not have been my fault. Oh my god. There is a rock golem down there and he looks mean. He's throwing rocks at us. He's throwing rocks at another guy. Are, are all these uh, mobs going to be different? Yeah. Awesome. Unique mobs, man. Oh my god. These rock golems actually move pretty quick. That guy was going lightning speed. He was out for blood. Snap. Are you down? Mm -hmm. I mean, that's a dumb question, but I mean. Oh, ow! Do some damage. I, I got might. you. Yeah, my grenades got me back up. Good deal. Alright, wait. I think we passed where we were supposed to go. Totally did. Let's go the other way. Yeah, we took a right when we were supposed to go straight, I guess. I guess. Just too distracted by new mobs and stuff and seeing it. I know. Them. I saw a rock golem and I just wanted to punch it. <laughs> oh, we can't get up this way. There's oh, an invisible wall. Right, other way then. Back to the trail. Back to the trail. <laughs> well, this music. Shortcut. Probably not. Yep. Can you get through there? Yep. Aren't you a smart kid? Da -na -na -na. Oh, ammo. <laughs> we got skelly bobs. Hey, ow, ow. Your arrows actually really hurt. Yeah, that's how I got down a minute ago. But my grenades got me back up. We'll have to relearn what the mobs do all over again. Just. I don't know what the hell their bows or arrows are coated with to be able to pierce futuristic shields. But it's something that's apparently more effective than bullets. Yeah. These bony, war like, dead warrior skeleton guys can deplete our high-tech future shields in one hit. Exactly. How is this possible? Show us your secrets. Kaboom! Such a glorious explosion. Yes. Oh, that guy's throwing his sword at us. 
Dude, this is cart the curtless. It's curtless ass. I like cart the way this area looks. <laughs> looks great. I don't know. What do you suppose is up in that nest? Up there in that tree. Up what? Ooh. Up there. Nest. There's a nest up there. Oh, you shot it. It Just went right through it. it. So there's nothing up there. Oh, that sounds bad. Oh, God. It is bad. Kaboom! Go get him, Death Trap. Ow. I had to do that so I could get him around and... Get around him and shoot him in the butt. I got him. Butt shots. Down. Well, that was that. What's that? Did you need that? No. Cool. Just, check just checking it out. It's like, it's like pseudo futuristic, you know? Yeah. It's like some of it looks like really medieval, and then some of it looks like really futuristic, like this. Yeah, I'm looking like, looking out here in the distance, and there's break the jars. Examples of the uh, old architecture, and then we go to this door. And so this a... fire, this ghost fire, it doesn't exist. <laughs> Dance in the ghost fire. Dance in the ghost Dance fire. In the ghost fire. Nothing. Nothing. What is this? That is some hardcore quantum yeah. physics going on there. Oh yeah. <laughs> you see the fire, but is it there? Hmm. <laughs> I was never good in physics. <laughs> I was never. Just, just, just a little. Just be honest. It's horrible at physics. <laughs> How does Apple go down? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> You've entered the town of Flame Rock Refuge. In the distance, you see the town's scouting blimps, always alert in case of battles and stuff. What you gonna do now? What you gonna do now? Stop playing this game. Shut up, Mordecai. Let's talk to some town folk. Okay. A grand idea. Are there any town folk, or is this a ghost town like the ghost fire? Probably. Okay, no, there's people in this town. Welcome there's a whole two people. Flame Rock Three, four. Okay, never mind. Oh yeah? You wanna bet? A sorcerer's tower is totally a place for heroes. I'll show you. Random dude with no name. The queen has gone missing. Maybe her bodyguard Eleanor knows where she went. The trees! If the queen doesn't return, <laughs> we shall never see the sun again! Oh no! Sounds like we should go find this Eleanor. Yeah, I'm gonna go find Eleanor, all right. Look at, no. look off in the distance at this tower and like, look at the sky around it. Is that the wizard's tower? Looks pretty suspicious to me. That lo totally looks like a wizard's tower. It looks like what Ganon's tower looks like. Yeah. At the very end. What is this, Legend of Zelda? Oh, that reminds me of a structure. What does it remind me of? It's like the little bridge right there in the middle. Is it from Halo? I think it's like on a... It reminds me kind of like Oblivion, of how, you know, those spires looked when you went into Oblivion. And like, sometimes the spires oh, were connected. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> so we're going in... Close shut the doors of Oblivion. <laughs> <laughs> That's what we're doing. I'm down. Uh, the bodyguard isn't here. Oh, yeah. whoops. Forgot to put her piece on the board. Blam! Oh, God. That looks like she got a problem. <laughs> I <laughs> much a problem. <laughs> I talked to her. In character, of course. <clears throat> Hello, madam. Is something the matter? The queen is missing. <laughs> she went into the forest to bring the light back to the world. So where'd she go? She said something about using the tree of life to undo the curse. That must be where she's going. And so I your purpose so. became clear. You gotta go to the forest and help the queen. Jeez, we're being sent everywhere. Okie doke. <laughs> yeah. We were in the docks, now we're in a town, now we're going to a forest. And all this is the end game to go into the wizard's tower. Welcome to Ye Old Bulletin A lot of places to go. <laughs> Welcome to Ye Old Bulletin Podium. Can I Let's interest you in some magic bullets? You're way down there. I left I you in the dust. Magic bullets. I was just getting some magic bullets real quick. Oh yeah. Oh crap. Yeah. That's a good idea. Ye old magic bullets. At least that's what Marcus called it. <laughs> My bullets aren't magic. 
but they are cheap. You have chosen wisely, wise chosen one. I love that the dialogue even changes. This is amazing. Looking for a healer? <laughs> You're in the right place. I shall see you soon. This is great. Awesome. Holy crap. This is a genuine DLC right here. It's, an, it's a whole new game. And the music is jamming. Yeah, I love it. It's like the drums behind the, uh, the violin. Nobody's technically that allowed in awesome. the forest since the world went dark, but the gatekeeper's a real pushover. Just tell him I sent you. Okay. Oh, hey. Chew Whoa. Up, honey. You are not a villager. Take it, animated skeleton. You don't have a chance. Solved. Taken care of. No problem. What's going on, gatekeeper? Can we go through? Yes, the queen went into the forest. It's too dangerous to go alone. I shall accompany you. Just one second, and... Great. Whoop, time out. I gotta take this. This Tina. Huh? It's Mr. Tor! Tina! Put me in the game! <laughs> okay! The gatekeeper is now Mr. Tor! Woo! Prepare to save you! <laughs> oh, wow. So I'm a gatekeeper, huh? In that case, you gotta prove your bad attitude to get past me! First task, blow up the village of scouting blimps with the fire weapon! Because... reasons! <laughs> <laughs> no kidding. <laughs> <laughs> Great! Thanks, Mr. Torg. Holy crap. Those things? The blimps are too far away to destroy the gunfire. It's like a puzzle! Mm. Maybe you should burn something connected to the blimps rather than the blimps themselves! Okay. Got it! Okay, I'll go to the other side. Torque is so extreme, it's awesome. I loved his guitar solo. Oh yeah. For fantasy. Never doing that again. <laughs> Catch fire! Ow! Why am I on fire? You were too close to your own explosion. We just destroyed the village's only way to see approaching threats. We had no reason to do that. <laughs> All right, that's task two. Go to the town tavern. Oh, okay. He's given us more than one task. I see what's going on here. You know what I love about this village? Not as much nothing. It feels like Fable, a little Wait, bit. This town doesn't have a, a little tavern. bit. Okay, you're at the tavern! <laughs> oh, wow. Okay. It's Moxie's tavern. Hooray! Wow, has a problem. Talk to her! Hey, what's going on? Hey, adventurer. I'm it's home, closing like, time. Mom. These idiots can't take a hint. Could you throw them out for me? Don't be afraid to get rough. Well, do. Go away! <laughs> Douchey bar patron. Get out of here, douchey bar patron. <laughs> Get out of here. Hey! Wait, 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 don't shoot him. Don't shoot him. Oh, this is gonna be good. <laughs> this is gonna be great. Chase him down. <laughs> Get him. <laughs> this is gonna be amazing. Head him off. I'm on his butt. Get him. Oh, oh my god! <laughs> this makes no sense. Torg is ruining your campaign. No, he's not. Uh, I'm this having better. Yeah, yeah I'm well with Brick. You're now badass enough to survive the forest. Apparently Great. to you. You just punched someone so hard they exploded. <laughs> <laughs> Think my job's complete? That was like the Grand Theft Auto 5 cheat. Explosion fists. You go up and punch someone and they explode. It's right. hilarious. <laughs> All right, before we turn this in, this is the end of the first episode, guys. Oh, yeah. To next time.
yes, see you next time. Thanks for watching. Peace!